Hi, I'm Tom Lopatoski, proprietor of Lopco Contracting. Today we're going to talk about glazing windows. Let's go. There's two things that I absolutely hate doing. One is taking down wallpaper. The other one is glazing windows. Glazing windows uh, is not a fun task. These days, it's becoming less of a thing to do because the uh, influx of replacement windows and people not having uh, the older style windows older style meaning the ones that operate on a weight and pulley behind the walls uh, you're not seeing it as much on this particular house as an example we're not uh, contracted to do the windows behind the storm windows but any area that has glazing associated with it that's exposed to the weather we are reglazing so what reglazing it does is it consists of a couple of things one is you got to take out the old glazing there's a little bit of loose glazing here that one of our guys has already removed uh, there's other types of glazing on this side that we try to get out of there but that just kind of maintains so short of stripping this with a heat gun uh, it's not going to come out so what do we do at this point how do we properly glaze this window so because the fact that we were able to get all that glazing out what we have to do now is prime this area right here with the appropriate primer we're going to prime these areas here with the appropriate primer and then we can uh, put our glazing in there there's a number of different glazings on the market uh, some of them i've seen are water based i'm more partial to the oil based there are not too many oil products, oil based products these days that I think are good because of a environment, uh, number of environmental laws that have uh, kind of taken out the VOCs from them over a period of time. VOCs stand for volatile organic compounds, which are very good in terms of a paint product, uh, add a tremendous amount of uh, endurance, life, etc. to it, but they're extremely bad for the environment. So why people have uh, yanked them out are uh, more environmentally uh, conscious, uh, to be more environmentally conscious. So a lot of the paint manufacturers, they've focused on the development of their acrylic products and their acrylic technologies over a long period of time. This has been coming for several years. It's not like it just appeared overnight. But glazing is one of those oil-based compounds that I still think is a, a bit better than the latex products that are on the uh, latex-based products that are on the market. Um, if you ask another painting contractor, 10 different ones, they might give you a different opinion. I'm more partial to the oil uh, still at this point. Uh, so then after you put the glazing on, uh, you apply it with a putty knife. Our guys are going to do that in a little bit over here. Uh, you make sure that you put the appropriate primer once the glazing has had a chance to properly set up. And then you can finish coat it with a regular 100% acrylic uh, finish coat.